I don't know if you've heard about the latest way to drink wine. The glasses are called Redneck Wine Glasses. Kind of a strange name, but I've looked at them online and they go from $10, $15, $20 a piece. And I thought, hmm, I can do that. And I did. Aren't these hilarious? Or as you, we used to say when we were children, too cool for school. These are so easy to make. I buy the bottom at the dollar store for a dollar. The top I buy at Bed Bath & Beyond like eight dollars for a dozen of them. So, so far it's not that much of an investment. And then I like to use E6000 glue to make sure I do it well. I'm going to bring up my other eyes. So I start just turning it upside down and I just go around the top of the crystal. You don't have to use Waterford, Steuben, Rosenthal. You can use plain old glue, plain old glass, and less than $2 investment. Then you just sort of smoosh it down a little. I kind of like the label to run up with one, line up with one of the front ones. Now after you're done with that, just sort of run your finger along to catch the extra glue right along the edge like that, doing it upside down. And then once it's secure and you've gotten all that glue off, turn it right side up. This glue, this E6000, dries in a half an hour, so you can get ready for your cocktail within a half an hour. And I just sort of rub it around in my hands like this until it gets hard on my hands and comes off. It's just easy to do that and then I'm done. Now let's see which one I did before this one. So I can fill it up. I decant my inexpensive wine. A lot of my girlfriends have told me they can teach me how to enjoy very expensive wines. But like I say, I'm fine not knowing that little secret. So here's to you for less than $2 for one redneck wine glass. Now, if you happen to have it on a hot summer day, and there might be bugs flying around, you can just keep the ball mason jar top and put it on, and then you will have a bug-proof glass of wine. Enjoy!